We are at a mudslide right off Ben Taylor Road in the Colfax area, in an unincorporated part of Placer County. The mudslide is on a, a private road here up above a county road, but we responded um, yesterday evening and that sheriff fire uh, to, this, to this big emergency event where we had all of this hillside uh, mud and debris washed down and hit a house and cover some roads and was threatening potentially houses uh, on either side of Ben Taylor Road. The obvious start with an emergency like this is, is law enforcement, fire and sheriff responding and dealing with the scene firsthand. What's going on? And then from there, there were two roads. One was evaluating the, the county road to make sure that was safe for the public, but also a private access road to see if that could be cleared and was safe for access to homes behind the slide. Uh, public Works um, was called out just to take a look at the situation. We've had slides on county roads, so we've got resources, geologists and, and geotechnical engineers on call. We have engineers in-house to take a look at this. And then the Community Development Resource Agency was called out too because they have engineers and building officials that respond to these types of uh, events and emergencies as well. And all of us were just seeing if it's going to flow into other houses and what kind of risk there is to the general public. So, I mean, there's all of us working together to, to try to figure this out in an emergency. The evaluation today included engineers from the county as well as private uh, geologists and geotechnical engineers, Cal OES and USGS, and the whole objective was evaluate the slide, evaluate the risks. And what we found was um, the slide has mostly stabilized. There was some potential for it to grow, but not to the extent where other homes in the area were in serious jeopardy. The one thing that we're gonna do for sure is to continue to monitor the slide with public safety in mind. There's a potential it could grow a little bit, but we wanna make sure that the access road stays safe. The other part of it is working with the private property owners to determine what the next steps are. That's not clear exactly at this point, but we're working together with um, all of the different stakeholders to make those, uh, make those recommendations and determinations.